There was a small businessman in a town. When his son grew up, he sent him to one of his friends who was known to be the wisest person in the world. He told his son, go and meet this wise man and he will tell you the secret of happiness. So the boy traveled in the desert for 40 days and finally reached to the address which has been given by his father. But instead of finding a saint over there, he found that there was a big castle and it was full of activity. He went inside and saw that many of the traders are coming in. This castle was very beautifully decorated. There was a table where all the tasty foods were also kept there. So that boy reached to that wise man and he has introduced himself and told that his father has sent him to find the secret of happiness. The man said, look, you see that I have got some guests who are here. I am a little busy. So what you do is you take a round of my palace and come back to me after two hours and then I will tell you the secret. He then gave him a spoon and there was two drops of oil in it. He said, you take a round of the palace, just see that this oil does not spill out. The boy carefully took a round of the palace. There were stairs, there were garden, there were many things in the palace. But his entire concentration was on that spoon where two drops of oil were there. After two hours, he came back to this wise man and proudly shown him that this oil is not spilled. The wise man asked, Did you see my garden, which has taken some eight years to be developed? Did you see that beautiful painting, which was there on the northern side of the castle? Did you see that beautiful sculpture, which was on the northern side of the castle? The boy hesitated. He said, I am sorry, sir. My entire concentration was on this spoon only. I could not see anything. So the wise man said that if you want to know me, you have to know where I am living, what are the things I have created. And so do one thing, take another round and come back to me after two hours. Now this time the boy was very careful. He looked at every small thing which was there in the palace. And after two hours he came back and he started describing everything in minute detail about that castle. Then the wise man asked, but where is the oil? Then that boy saw that the oil in the spoon has totally spilled and it was not at all there. Then the wise man explained that the secret of happiness is to see the beauty of the world but at the same time ensure that the oil in your teaspoon does not spill out. Friends, this is how life is. Some people are too much busy on their duties and responsibilities just like this boy was busy in focusing his attention that the oil does not spill out. He considered that as a duty and he was unable to see the beauty of the world. On the other side, there are some people who are totally engrossed in the external beauty of the world and they are unable to carry out their responsibilities and duties and they spill out all the oil which is there in the teaspoon. So if we want to be happy in this world, we must pay attention to our duties and responsibilities on one side and on the other side. We should also love this world, love this beautiful world, enjoy the beauty of this world. And when we are able to do both simultaneously in this life, we can live a happy life.